Major General Joseph Saidu Momo, or OBE, January 26, 1937 to August 3, 2003, served as President of Sierra Leone from November 1985 to April 29, 1992. Joseph Saidu Momo was born on January 26, 1937 in Vincolo, Bombali district in the northern province of British Sierra Leone to Limba parents. In the early 1940s, his family moved to Freetown then Wilberforce. His family were Christians. From 1951 to 1955, he was educated at the West African Methodist Collegiate School. Momo was very athletic and enjoyed playing tennis, basketball and volleyball. He played competitive football for the Young Stars FC at McKenney and Blackpool FC. He completed his education at the Government Clerks School, Technical Institute. In 1956, Momo worked as third grade clerk in Sierra Leone's civil service. He resigned from this position in 1958 in order to join in the armed forces. Momo's military career began in 1958, when he enlisted in the Royal West African Frontier Force RWAFF, as a private. He trained at the Regular Officers Training School in Ghana and the Nigerian Military Training Academy. He then travelled to the United Kingdom to train at the School of Infantry at High than the Mons Officers Cadet School in Aldershot. He was commissioned as second lieutenant in the Royal Sierra Leone Military Forces in 1963. He was elevated to the rank of Major and given command at Moa Barracks, Kailahoon. In 1969, Momo became Lieutenant Colonel and Commanding Officer of the 1st Battalion. A year later, he was promoted to the rank of Colonel. He was appointed Deputy Force Commander in 1971 by President Siaka Stevens, after a coup attempt by Brigadier John Bangura. Momo succeeded Bangura as Force Commander in November 1971. In 1974, he was appointed Minister of State with cabinet status. He became Major General in 1983. President of Sierra Leone. In 1985, Momo became Secretary General and Head of the All People's Congress, APC. The same year, he succeeded President Siaka Stevens by becoming the only candidate in a one-party election in the form of a referendum on 8 October 1985. Momo became the second president of Sierra Leone and he served from November 28, 1985 to April 29, 1992. Momo declared a state of economic emergency early in his rule, granting himself greater control over Sierra Leone's economy, but he was not regarded as a dictator. Instead, his people viewed him as far too weak and inattentive to the affairs of state, allowing his notoriously corrupt advisers to manipulate matters behind the scenes. President Momo appears on the Leone. Momo has inherited a disintegrating economy from his predecessor and he was unable to stop the trend. The country's currency decreased in value. Sierra Leone reached the point under President Momo where it could not afford to import gasoline and fuel oil, and the country went without electricity for months at a time. On 23 March 1987, police reported that a group of conspirators was plotting to assassinate Momo and stage a coup d'etat after they raided a house in Freetown and discovered a cache of weapons, including rocket launchers. James Bambe Kamara, the formidable Inspector General of the Sierra Leone Police, gave the order to arrest first Vice President Francis Minor, GMT. Kaikai, Jamil Sahid Mohammed and 15 others. Minor was a personal friend of Momo and while he did not personally believe that Minor was involved in the plot, he did not want to oppose Inspector General Kamara. Momo did not intervene on behalf of Minor. The treason trial went on for five months until October 1987 when the jury delivered a guilty verdict. 
the former first vice president and 17 others were convicted of treason and sentenced to death. Jamil Saheed Muhammad escaped to Lebanon where he remained in exile. They were executed on warrants signed by Momo. The SCIPA group was an Israeli mineral company led by Nir Gwaz that arrived in Sierra Leone in 1989. SCIPA bought its way into Momo's favor by providing the government with loans and enabling Sierra Leone to enter into negotiations with the International Monetary Fund. On Christmas Eve 1989, Momo had Guaz arrested, charged with economic sabotage and deported from Sierra Leone. In September 1991, after the start of the Sierra Leone Civil War, Momo ushered in a new constitution which dismantled the one-party state established in 1978 and instituting multi-party democracy. He also played a great part in dissolving tribalism military coup. However, Momo's efforts at reform came too late to rescue Sierra Leone from chaos. He was overthrown in a military coup staged by Valentine Strasser, a 25-year-old army captain, in April 1992. In April 1992, a group of young soldiers marched to Freetown from the war front where they had been fighting the Revolutionary United Front, RUF, led by Fode Sanko. Incensed by terrible working conditions, unpaid salaries and a lack of government support they staged a coup d'etat. On 29 April 1992, the soldiers, led by Captain Valentine Strasser announced the military coup on the radio. Momo fled to Guinea and sought political asylum. Exile and death. Momo was granted political asylum in neighboring Guinea by President Lansana Conte. He took up residence in a mansion in Nongo Tadi, Conakry. Momo died on August 2, 2003, at the age of 66. Momo spent the last years of his life as a guest of the military government in neighboring Guinea, where he died in exile in 2003. Ironically Fode Sanko had died a few days earlier.